What's going on guys? It's been a minute since I've done an update, so I figured I'd go ahead and get into it here for you. Uh, it's now day 115. Uh, everything is doing great for me so far. Everything's doing awesome actually. Uh, not a whole lot's changed since my last update. A uh, couple new pieces of coral, but not, not really a whole lot of anything. Uh, so we'll kind of go ahead and get into the tank here and kind of show you what's going on. Uh, over here, these guys are doing awesome. Uh, color of those are really nice. They're starting to puff up today. So, uh, And I did want to show you a couple little new heads starting on this. If you can see at that very bottom, that little piece of green in the bottom right hand corner, that's a new little head popping up out of there. Uh, and there's also another one in between those bigger ones. And then over here at the top, right in the very middle of those two big ones there on the top, you can see a little, little one starting up right there. So that's pretty cool. Uh, this guy just picked him up out of the sand, but colors are still really awesome even though it's not opened up. Uh, the crabs just get behind there and basically throw that thing down every night. So I need to figure out something to do with that, but it's really nice. Coraline popping up everywhere. Everything's doing great. I'm loving this little 10 gallon tank. I, got, I did get this new little mushroom. It's actually a really good size. It opens up huge. It's kind of curled up right now, but it's a really cool green color. These eagle eyes up here. I need to cut that little stalk of anthelia out of there. It's getting on my nerves, but too lazy. I did get this new frag of Zoas that are just awesome. I mean, the color of these under the actinics are are crazy. I mean, and they're glowing like this under the daylight, so you can just kind of imagine it with the actinics. <coughs> excuse me, actinics on. Uh, but I don't really know the name of these. I've been doing some research, trying to find some photos of of ones that look similar to this. Um, they do look kind of like flaming suns, but there's a little bit more blue on the edges of those. Mine has a little little bitty thin layer of blue and then it turns to green but they're really cool so if you guys can name those uh, hit me up in the comments below or give me a PM or whatever that'd be awesome this damsel will get out of the way this frog spawn is doing great uh, it's huge just filling that whole space right there Some more Duncans down here. Glass is filthy. Uh, Kenya tree's doing good. Uh, this one was kind of messing with a minute ago, so it's not fully opened up. Little purple mushroom over here. Alleys. This guy doing awesome too. How spread wide open it is, it's crazy. See the mouth there. This hammer's getting pretty big too. It extends pretty big once it's fully opened up. Kind of curls around the back there. Yeah, that's basically it, guys. You can see I still have the tomato clown. And he's kind of calmed down a little bit, so we'll see how it goes with him. Kind of starting to mind his own business. He still kind of picks on the damsel a little bit, but not as much as he did. I mean, you can see he's not really, not really bothering him too bad, so that's pretty cool. Uh, but other than that, I mean, that's basically about it, guys. I just kind of wanted to give a, give you a run through of the tank, uh, show you what was going on here. Uh, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for my next next video. Peace.